a little girl's remains found along the shoreline of the Boston Harbor just two weeks ago. Authorities have posted this computer-generated image of the little one in the hopes that someone will recognize her. The number of uh, views online is soaring, some 47 million plus. So far, though, no luck identifying this little girl who's become simply known as Baby Doe. Give us up-to-date information, at least what you can, without compromising the investigation on, wh on what they are doing right now. Obviously, they're going to look through missing persons records, uh, talk to any families who have had uh, their children go missing. What else, what, is, what else is being done? Well, you know, the fact that we're getting so much attention in this case is overwhelming, too, at times. Uh, lots of people are calling in with tips and leads, and we want that to continue. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a, With that information, we, we're going out there and we're checking on the welfare of a lot of children. I think there's been over 24 actual welfare checks on children who resembled Baby Doe, and there are others out there as well. At the National Center, we're, we're sifting through our reports of missing children, and so far there haven't been any matches. But I think... But it's important that the public, uh, if they think they know who this child might be, to call us. Because I think then what we can do is use the DNA science to confirm or, or not confirm who this child is. So we need the public's help that can stay. And again, I think, I think we're also up against a vacation season oh, where a lot point. of people are away. And you know, there's a lot of assumptions, too, about whether a caretaker is involved or not. And frankly, we don't know. Uh, until we find that child. Well, I suppose you have to not make assumptions, right? You can't assume that this is a Caucasian little one. This baby could be uh, a Latina. She could also be from overseas. I mean, the, the family involved could be undocumented. I mean, you have to explore literally every possibility. Oh, absolutely, and the fact that we have really saturated the New England states uh, with information about Baby Doe, but when in fact you're absolutely right, she could be from another region of the country altogether, if not uh, Hispanic or possibly from Mexico or even Canada. So all those possibilities are, are out there, and uh, so we don't want to close our minds to what we think might be or make assumptions. Uh, again, you know, and I, the other assumption could be is it was whether a parent or caretaker is involved, mm. when in fact the caretaker or parent could be missing themselves. Uh, so we have to keep those kind of things in mind.